Well, Eastern Carolina residents are early voting for the second time in the state this year. Celeste Ward is live at a polling location in Greenville. She talked to a voter and a Pitt County Board of Elections official and has more details. Celeste. Courtney, I'm here at the headquarters for the Board of Elections, the only place this time around to elect Republican Party candidates in Pitt County. In an uncommon runoff race, residents could be seen casting their ballot in the annex of the Board of Elections building in Greenville on Friday. Election officials say second primaries are being held statewide for the Republican nomination for lieutenant governor and state auditor. They say re registered Republicans and unaffiliated voters who did not vote or voted the Republican ballot in the first primary are eligible. Joyner said it's important to vote to set a good example for the next generation. In my own family, I have children that... Uh a polling precinct's the furthest thing from their mind. And I got to do a better job of educating them about their responsibilities so that uh, they do participate one day. Election officials say second primaries are also being held statewide for the Republican nomination for Lieutenant, Lieutenant Governor, State Auditor, and Republican nomination for U.S. House District 13, which includes Caswell, Person, Franklin, Lee, Harnett, and Johnson counties, as well as parts of Wake and Granville counties. And Pitt County Board of Elections officials say as of 6 o'clock p.m., 17 residents have voted in the second primary election thus far. Reporting live in Greenville, Celeste Ford, WITN News. All right, thanks, Celeste. And election day is May 14th with polls opening that day from 6.30 a.m. to 7.30 p.m. You'll need to vote at your precinct on that day.